for allowing some of these individual labor innovators to become startups and enterprises of the future. While it's being set up in Mumbai in Film City, it will also have multiple regional spokes and one of its regional centers is also going to be in Hyderabad. And uh, I'm pretty confident that the message given by the Honorable Prime Minister in his Independence, Independence Day speech from Red Fort was that India should develop world class animators and, and uh, we'll have the meeting with the industry, that is the film industry, the producer associations, and uh, there's a huge participation of the Telugu film industry. Telugu film industry has a uh, very important role and uh, the International Film Festival of India is to celebrate the filmmakers and the cine goers. So it's a, uh, it's a, it's a very important event and I am pretty confident that uh, we will get a good participation from the Telugu industry, Telugu film industry. Next is the uh, in-app purchases or through some subscriptions or through some advertisements. So all this is completely legal and that's why this industry needs to be supported because otherwise uh, uh, you will have games uh, coming out from rest of the world populating your own country while we ourselves have a huge story telling uh, history, uh, rich cultural heritage of storytelling. So it's uh, and that you can see downstairs. So our capabilities in creating our own games and uh, I think this is what, uh, this is one area where we need to harness and uh, develop capabilities and allow uh, young innovators to not just create games but at the same time become enterprises which, which makes money and uh, uh, you know uh, provide employment opportunities to many. So I think this distinction is very important. Gambling in our constitution is in the state list. So that call will be taken always by the states. At the same time, more importantly, an FM radio is like more of a hyper local entertainment, local language, local dialect. I think that is what is uh, makes makes FM radio so very important and critical, right? It provides very customized uh, a 40 square kilometer reach area, and in that area you are going to have uh, an event summit would be held in New Delhi from 5th February of 2025, it's a five day event and World Audiovisual and Entertainment Summit that is WAVES is going to be a convergence event for the broadcasting and the traditional uh, radio and other segments that you all understand. Then the entire vertical of animation, visual effects, gaming, the segment that we are discussing here. Then also the new media segment, the social media, the OTT etc and the film's vertical that, again the traditional way that we all know. So it's the first event in the world which is a convergence event which will bring the entire industry, the entire media entertainment industry together and uh, we're very hopeful that an event of that nature which is being conducted at a, um, a significant scale and size will bring world eyeballs to India and I board member of Jedi, which is Game Developer Association of India. Look here, sir. I've been gaming, I've been in gaming for 15 years and associated with IGDC, which is the India Game Developer Conference, one of the largest gaming developer conference in the world and been associated with it for more than a decade. Uh, today, in IGDC, uh, we had opportunity as industry leaders to interact with Mr. Sanjay Jaju, uh, MIP secretary, and we had a very interesting discussion and conversation about how gaming can be a very, very big opportunity, how video gaming can be a very big opportunity for India to generate revenues, to generate jobs. Uh, we, we have been constantly talking about, and we are happy to share that video gaming and interactive entertainment is a creative and a content business and 